welcome to my channel. My name is Nonzi. The name I would like you to call me is Nonzi. <laughs> be doing a series one get to know me I know no one asked no one wanted to know who I am at least for now I'm trying to catch up with YouTube of the thing I'm trying to get back on here I'm trying to be more consistent and less pessimistic about everything it's that kind of thing like oh he's gonna listen to me he's going to watch this I would make a lot of mistakes, it's not worth it, I'm too shy, and whatnot. So first and foremost, I would like to make um, an official introduction of who I am for your viewing pleasure. My name is Onome Joseph, I'm a graduate of University of Benin. <laughs> I studied English and Literature in Faculty of Education. So it's kind of a double or no to look at and it, yeah, that kind of a thing. I'm from Bayelsa State and um, yeah, I am Nigeria first, Nigerian first, then I am from Bayelsa State. Bayelsa is in the far south, southern part of Nigeria. Yeah, one of the oil producing states. And please don't say I'm living on money. Nah, that's not true just put it here on social media <laughs> okay before I continue I'd like to apologize please bear with me my hands they keep moving on their own I can't even control ah. <sighs> I'm an introvert first sometimes I get tired of being an introvert sometimes I wish I'm extroverted but that's how it works it's a personality I can hardly fight. I just have to live with it. I enjoy it most of the time. Don't get me wrong. I love introversion. I love my alone time. I love refueling, and that's just one of the best moments of my life. <laughs> when I'm alone in my room, minding my business, and keeping my head down. Remember, I said I'm sorry about times. Honestly, this is kind of difficult to answer because I do quite a lot of things that may not resonate as something meaningful to you. That's just the thing. First, I am a blogger. I own a blog and I have been blogging inconsistently at blogtrover.com. I kind of started a blog in 2016 as a hobby. Then I started trying to monetize it in 2019 when I discovered that babe there's more to just only the blog and writing you need to start making money from it recently i've been trying to go more professional although it's very difficult for someone like me my writing style is so personalized and um it's kind of difficult to just switch parts try to be serious try to write stuff that um that tells the reader okay i'm being serious about it I'm trying to be a lot, a lot more serious. Apart from blogging, I do a number of side hustles online. Some are doing okay, some are not in your okay, and some I'm battling to make just perfect for me. Trust me, trust me, I want to make money online. That's all the thing. But I have issues with consistency. Master of procrastination. <laughs> you can call me whatever you want right now, but that's the truth. And I'm being truthful here. I'm, I want to be open with you. I want you to know more about me because I believe the journey I'm about to embark on is going to be an amazing one, especially when it becomes successful, when it goes from grass to grace. My online hustle, I, I want to make it, make it big. <laughs> Apart from my side hustles, I still freelance. I would, have, I would have fixed freelancing into my side hustles, but the truth is I can't at this point because it's a different thing entirely. I do, I do it at will. That's when I get clients to work with. I use Fiverr currently. 
I do quite a few things. I used to write, but I stopped writing for people for some reasons because um, most of my clients were local clients, and you know how that thing is. Some people do not pay where well. I wouldn't blame people do. It's what you have you can offer. So I just had to stop and decided to go into graphics. I'm not a pro. That's a funny thing. I read for the fun of it, and I discovered okay, I could make a few dollars from this because there are a lot of people that don't even want to spend time doing little graphic changes so I fit myself in there and I've worked with a few clients successfully no complaints yet I'm still a baby on five but I just leave my gigs there until someone comes and says okay babe we want you to do this for us but I need something bigger I'm not really focusing on five that's that <laughs> Hmm, this channel, well, basically, it's going to be more or less a vlog for my blog. Although I may have some separate topics discussed here that wouldn't go on the blog. My blog is basically about lifestyle and online hustle. And that's what this channel will be about also. I will be talking about life in general, self-development, self-care, introversion, procrastination, stuff like that. Live, life, fun, jokes, all those kind of thing. Then I will also be talking about side hustles. I have a lot to talk about. I have a lot to go into. I have a lot to document. And I feel my YouTube channel will help me keep track of this, watch my progress, and have others also key into my techniques, join my journey, learn from each other, stuff like that. So live hustle online hustle and all that yeah if i want to answer this question honestly fear fear is crazy trust me it took a lot to get me out of my shell i'm glad i am gradually stepping into the stage of i don't care so long i'm trying my best i think some people we appreciate him. You can't know it all and everyone cannot appreciate you. That's the funny thing about life. If you're waiting to be loved by everyone or more, <laughs> you're on the long team. And I think I stopped at that. So it's a learning process and I'm glad I'm making progress now. One other thing that not one other thing, other things that held me back is one procrastination. Hmm. Two self sabotage. Three perfectionism ah in fact i have to give it up to perfectionism after fear i'll fix perfectionism i wanted to be perfect i wanted a perfect channel i wanted a perfect life but i realized i did wait for perfect life i'm not making progress it makes no sense yeah this channel first is to help me grow it's to help me boost my confidence to help me build myself I've been too scared, I've been hiding away for too long, it's been far too long, I need to break out of this self-indoctrination of, of no one cares, no one would want to listen to you, no one would like you, no, that's not what I want, I'm changing, I'm not too old for a change, like I said, no time is too late, so long you're still alive, I don't know who said that, but I think I am the one that just said it. Okay guys, so it's short. The video is short, right? Huh. I don't know, but I just tried. I tried this my first video. Come on, give me a break. It's <laughs> Okay. <clears throat> it's a gradual process. I'm getting there. I will do better. I hope to keep this channel alive. I honestly hope to keep it alive. I went as fast buying a tripod, getting myself some backdrops just material but it's something it's a good start i saw some channels i kind of had to watch a lot of youtube channel to encourage me make my first of ever official and i think the best for now video mm, yeah it's definitely the best if you view my previous videos it's all about me talking in the background or me using some good voice 
I want to do this a lot. Like I'm enjoying it. I'm kind of anxious. You may have noticed my hands should give should give that away, but just ignore. I didn't thought that so much. I thought I would do a lot of stuff stuff Okay. <laughs> But that didn't happen as I expected and guys yeah, proud of herself. So guys, that's all for this video. What do I do next? Okay, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That would keep me encouraged and um <laughs> bye! <laughs>